Well, all right then. Here goes some more food for the sheep. Many of you don't know that uh, coming up here at the end of the month, Adam Kokesh and, oh, I don't know, 1,200 or so other military members are going to march on the Capitol. I don't know if you, did I mention that? I think it's on my list and I didn't get to it. I'm going to jump to it now after this lamestream media governmental control bullshit. Okay, the government knows about this because obviously if I know about it, they know about it. They know about me, they know about you, they know about it. Okay, we can. We don't have to discuss that. We're all on the same page there. So they're going to make the first move by putting more security around the Capitol ahead of time and justifying it, making you a little more scared while they do it. Okay, reading from the post, link will be below. The FBI on Friday arrested a man suspected of planning to carry out a suicide attack against the U.S. Capitol, but the would-be suicide bomber, identified as Moroccan National, was a target of a lengthy FBI undercover investigation, and the public was never in any danger. Keep that in mind when they start taking away some of your privileges over there around the Capitol in the coming weeks, uh, that you were never in any danger. Okay, remember that. FBI and Justice Department officials stressed. The man, identified as Amin El Khalifi, oh, of course that's what his name was, 29, was expected to be indicted on federal terrorism-related charges in Alexandria, Virginia. The would-be suicide vest the man wore reportedly given to him by FBI undercover agents posing as accomplices in, a, in the sting. As he approached the Capitol Friday and has been previously rendered harmless. Wow. So, this is how we keep you in fear. Is we sell fake bombs to people that have had enough. Or or maybe we don't sell them. Maybe we just give them to them and, and pay them to deliver them. Play the part. Okay. This guy's going to prison anyway. You know, maybe we can give him a half a mil, have him walk around with his vest on, then hem him up shortly later, take the money back, get all the sheep in line while we close off the city before Kokesh gets here. That's, that's what I'm seeing. I, I don't know. Uh, you tell me, but I, I think this is a big chess game. And I think they know what our move is going to be, so they're trying to counteract it now. Well, just remember, when you're looking over there, you get hit from over there. So, just link will be below. Tell me what you think. Bye!